Hello, this is Clint again with another episode of Killer Attacker Robots. This is Episode 7, Season 2 of Random Anime Time. The anime we're covering today is Comet Lucifer. This is a mecha anime set in an alternate world. This world seems to have all sorts of futuristic technology and, and focus on gems and crystals and stuff. That and the flying scooter kind of reminds me a lot of the anime Eureka 7. The main character's name is Sogo, and he likes to mess with machines. He also has a hobby as a geologist or something. So yeah, one day when he's looking for gems, he's hit by a magical light, and uh, yeah, this, this light becomes a pretty little stone. Then, somewhere along the road, the stone turned into a girl. Then, he accidentally summoned a giant robot from his hand. Yeah. You have no idea what's going on? Well, neither do I. So this anime is actually really pretty. Not much was shown in the first episode, but they did introduce a lot of characters. And they gave a lot of hints towards the bad guys, what they're after, and they've shown a lot of beautiful scenes of the city. Um, this helps a lot towards story building, and is usually a sign for a really good show. Overall, I liked it. The animation is great, um, the voice acting was pretty good, and the story was also pretty good, even though they didn't really show much. It seems to stay well within the stereotypical magical mecha template, and while that's not really a bad thing, I kind of wish they had the balls to make this show more interesting. I'm definitely going to be watching the rest of this, though. So far, this looks like it's the best anime of the season. Yeah, even more than that Gundam series that I reviewed last episode. But it's only the first episode, and I can't wait to see who fucks it up first. So, I'm going to be giving this my damned good rating, because uh, this anime was actually, like, this close to getting my epic rating, which I barely ever give out. But this show is just missing that emotional punch that required for me to give it a perfect score. Although now that I think about it, the last anime that I gave an epic rating to was Tokyo Ghoul. And that's just because that show was fucking amazing. Um, but yeah, that was a while ago. Before I even started to post reviews to this YouTube channel. Um... So that aside, yeah, if you liked this review, give it a like. And if you want to leave a comment on how my standards are just too high, then go ahead and do that. And uh, if you want to see more videos like this, please subscribe. May the mecha be with you.